Today, I'm going to show you how I make my version of Nuln Oil. I print and paint a lot of 3D terrain, and if I was to use these little bottles to shade all that terrain, it would cost a fortune. Instead, I make my own Nuln Oil just for my terrain and I'll show you how I make it. All right, so we'll need a few provisions. First off, a bottle, kind of self-explanatory. Some water. Some people prefer using distilled water. I'm just using tap water. Some Liquidex matte medium. Some airbrush flow improver. You can also use jet dry, but I find it causes way too many bubbles. And then some ink. I'm using some black uh, acrylic ink and some brown ink. All right, let's get this bottle opened up. Now we're gonna fill it about halfway with the water. And we go with the acrylic medium. I tend to put about 40% of the amount of water I'd put uh, in the medium. Then a few drops of the flow improver. If you're using the jet dry, I'd use a little bit less, maybe three or four drops, that's all. Now, I'm going to give it a shake before I add the ink. It ends up being the consistency of uh, some milk, basically. Now, for the ink. Always start off with less because you can't remove it. Um, in this case, I'm putting about 15 drops or so. Then. I'm going to add a few drops of the brown ink. Now seal the bottle up and let's give it a good shake. Yeah, it's looking a little bit on the gray side, uh, but let's test it out with a uh, sacrificial miniature here. So I've got this aberrant that uh, I've already dry, dry brushed with a gray. Let's uh, try some of the ink wash. Yeah, it's too pale for my liking at this point. So let's go back and we'll add some more of the black ink. Yeah, that looks a lot better. Well, there you have it. That's how I make my Nuln Oil. Uh, if you've got your own recipe, please put in the comments how you do yours. If you haven't already, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Thanks, and see you next time.